Hello, everyone. I'm Upasna, and I'm going to present about GNOME's Outreach Program for Women. GNOME's Outreach Program for Women helps people who identify as women, cis, or trans to get involved with free and open source software. Uh, it involves tasks apart from coding as well, like documentation, testing, marketing, community management, support, etc. And Wikimedia, Linux Kernel, OpenStack Foundation, and Mozilla are some of the regular participants. Uh, but Pearl participated only twice, sadly. Uh, now, something about me. I'm an Indian, now working in Amsterdam. And as you might have guessed, since I'm working in Amsterdam, so uh, I'm working for bo booking. I started last week. And I'm around, I'm uh, an OPW round six intern. And I worked on structured exceptions in Moose. And I'm a first time YAPSI attendee. And this is my first talk at any poll conference or any technical conference. Thank you. Uh, so how OPW benefited me? Uh, I got 5,000 US dollars for doing more structured exceptions in Moose, which is considered a really huge amount in India. Uh, I got sponsorship from GNOME Foundation, Pearl Foundation, and Enlightened Pearl Organization for coming to Bulgaria and meeting you all. And I met so many people while working on Moose uh, from, who are from different cultures from all over the world. And I enhanced my Pearl skills. A big thanks to my mentors, Sean Moore and Jesse Lewis, and the whole Moose team for <laughs> training me. And you all could become a part of OPW. For becoming a mentee, uh, you need to choose a project. Uh, you need to con contact the cons concerned mentors via email or IRC. And you need to ask him or her how, to, how you could contribute to the project. And then contribute, contribute, and contribute. And if you have more time, then go back to the previous step. And then wait for the results. And for becoming a mentor, we are really short of mentors. Uh, you need to have an idea on which you, your mentee could work for at least three months. That project should be free and open source. That project should be uh, useful for the community. And make sure that you have enough time for communicating with your student. Though the internship is remote, but generally people are uh, reluctant to become a mentor because they are short of time. So time is really, really uh, a huge uh, thing which we need for, um, for being a mentor. Then here are some important dates. On September 8, uh, it will be announced like which organizations are being participating. And on, from September 8 to 22, applicants need to get in touch with mentors. On September 22, application system opens. On October 22 is the deadline for submitting your application. And uh, I would like to tell you one thing that uh, if you are if you submit your if you'll submit your application without contributing, then you'll not be entertained. Uh, on November 12, you can uh, selected participants will be all, uh, announced on this site, and then internship period. And Pearl is participating in the next round, so please. Uh, so uh, please contact us uh, for if you are interested in becoming a mentee or a mentor. Uh, for more information, you can uh, go to this link and you can contact Karen Pole at uh, karen at pearlfoundation.org. For mentees, uh, you need 
to contact Concerned Mentors, and you could also email me if you have any questions about outreach program for women, or if you just want to know about more of my experience. And for donating money to Pearl, you can go on this site. We love donations. And for other people who, got, uh, who want to get involved with FOSS, because I have some uh, friends who are not women, but they want to get into FOSS. So if you are one of them, then please go to this site, openhash.org. It is very helpful for beginners. It helps beginners to uh, participate in FOSS, uh, but uh, you don't get paid for it. Sorry. Uh, and Google Summer of Code, but it is only for students. And OPW is not only for students. And thank you for listening to me. And if you have any questions, then feel free to email me at me or at upasna.me. And uh, you can also catch me after this talk if you have any questions. Thank you. <laughs>